guys, welcome back to my channel, it's Katerina and I hope you're having a great day so far. Today's video is going to be my top 10 favorite spring lipsticks. This video is also in collaboration with my girl Devin Skiles here on YouTube. I will link her video down below as well as her channel. She's also a fellow drugstore lover and she has beautiful long blonde hair, amazing tutorials. You guys are going to love her videos and I'll link her down below so make sure you guys check her out. Yeah, I'm just going to take you through arm and lip swatches of my top 10 favorite lipsticks. These are all drugstore. I really hope that you guys enjoy this video and let's get started. So this is the first lipstick right here. Well, in this case, it's actually a lip gloss, but it's so pigmented, it's kind of like a liquid lipstick, so we're still getting that pigment in there. This is the Maybelline Color Elixir in the shade Petal Plush. I really like this one because it is a no-fuss lip product. You apply it once, it goes on very evenly, it's not cakey, it's not sticky, and it lasts a really long time as well. I feel like this is a perfect spring slash summer shade because it's very light, has a very slight shade of pink in there, so it's kind of like a nudie pink lip, which goes with anything and adds a little color to the look. So we have another lip gloss, but this again is so pigmented, and this is one of my favorite products from the drugstore. This is one of the NYX lip butters in the shade Meringue. It is the perfect kind of bright but soft pink at the same time. These are the most comfortable lip products that I've ever tried. They go on so smooth. They have a really nice vanilla fragrance, which I personally really enjoy, and they're really pigmented as well. This one is kind of like a soft blue-ish base pink, but still has a little pow in there, and I think it's perfect for spring. This is the next lipstick right here. This is from the Revlon Super Lustrous line in the shade Primrose. I actually mentioned this in my last video, which was my top 10 products under $10. I love this lipstick so much. It is suitable for all skin tones, any hair color, eye color. It's going to work great with you. And I think that in general just goes really well with spring. It's kind of like a very mid-tone, soft, blue-ish base pink. Again, you guys know those are kind of like my favorite. And I really like this. This formula is a cream formula. It's very pigmented and it's not patchy. It's very smooth on the lips and very comfortable on the lips which I love. This is the next lipstick right here. It kind of looks a little crazy on camera, but I think that's because of all the lights. If you're wanting to refer, it's pretty much the same exact color as my earring. And this is one of the NYX round lipsticks in the shade Pure Nude, which it's not really a nude. It's a very soft, light, orangey coral, and I love it for spring. Again, these NYX round lipsticks are so creamy and smooth. They feel like butter on the lips, and they, they just have really nice pigmentation. They're not the longest lasting lip product, but it's really easy to apply. You can keep reapplying, and it's not gonna look patchy or cakey or anything like that. I love this color for spring and summer. I feel like it's even better for summer when you have a darkish brown maroon lip liner to kind of create some definition so it doesn't look super flat, but I love this lipstick. So this is the next lipstick right here. This is from the new Rebel Bloom collection from Maybelline, and it is actually a permanent collection. I thought it was something that was just going to be seasonal, but I'm so glad that they made a permanent collection. So this is in the shade Peach Poppy. It is kind of similar to the last shade, but more intense, more vibrant, a little bit deeper of a 
orangey coral, but still beautiful, perfect for spring. The one thing I have to say about these lipsticks is they do sometimes the lighter shades go on a little bit patchy, so you really want to make sure that you exfoliate your lips because it's going to cling to any dry patches like you can kind of see over here on this side. But all in all, I love these lipsticks. I have quite a few of if them. If you're looking for a nice spring lipstick and you don't know what to get, check out the Maybelline Rebel Bloom Collection because those were specifically made for spring. And they're very nice, kind of like vibrant but pastel colors at the same time, and they're beautiful. So this is the next lipstick. It's also from the Maybelline Rebel Bloom Collection. This one is in the shade Lilac Flesh. If you guys saw my top 10 favorite purple lipsticks, you saw that in there. I was trying not to include a lot of those from that video because I did lip swatches for all my favorite purple lipsticks, which I wear year round, but I really like for spring and summer as well. This one is in the shade Lilac Flesh. It's a beautiful lilac shade. It's a wearable shade, I think, though, because it does have quite a bit of pink in there as well. It's not just straight purple, but I love this. It's a unique color, but fun at the same time. Perfect for spring. Next we have one of the Maybelline Vivids collections. Let's take the shade is Pink Pop. Honestly, you can never go wrong with one of the Maybelline Vivids collection. They have a beautiful range from oranges and purples and pinks and reds. They're just some of my all-time favorite lipsticks. And this one is one of my favorites also for spring because it's just a very bright in-your-face pink, but still wearable at the same time. It's not This is the next lipstick right here. This is from the Milani Color Statement line. They have another range of beautiful selections. The only thing about these lipsticks are they are a little bit hard to apply, but once you get them on, they are so pigmented and smooth, and they kind of have more of a matte satin finish, which I kind of like. This is in the shade Flamingo Pose. It is just a gorgeous, deeper kind of orangey coral shade, but it is almost neon because it is just so bright. I love this for spring and summer. It looks wonderful with the tan, and it's just one of my staples. So like we said, we have another Milani color statement. This is in the shade Violet Volt. It is gorgeous. It's one of my favorite shades from that line. And again, I didn't mention this in the last lipstick, but they kind of have like a sweet, almost cotton candy kind of scent to them, which I personally like. I like scented lipsticks as long as it's kind of like a sweet um, scent, not really like a fragrant scent. I love this lipstick. Again, I also mentioned this in my top 10 favorite purple lipsticks, but I wasn't trying to mention all of those in this video, because if it was up to me, I'd probably wear purple lipstick every day in some way or another. It is very purple, very vibrant, and it makes your teeth look white, makes you look tan. I just cannot say enough good things about this lipstick. So this is the last lipstick right here. This color gives me life. It is my favorite red lipstick. And this is from the Jordana Modern Matte Lipsticks. They're fairly new, and this is in the shade Matte Style. It is stunning. Something that I really like about spring and summer is you know how we like to achieve that glowy face, glowy skin? But then pairing it with a really bold matte lip, I just love that combination. I think it is so gorgeous. It's such a beautiful 
bright, hot, hot red. It is more on the bluer based side of a red instead of an orange base, but it is just so beautiful. Again, I think this is gonna look great with a tan. I absolutely love this lipstick. It is so pigmented. The one con I have about these lipsticks is that they are a little bit hard to apply since they are so matte. You kind of have to, I would recommend using a lip liner, that way you can kind of stay in the lines and you can avoid any bleeding or feathering with these, but I love them, they are stunning. All right, you guys, I think it is safe to say we are done with our lip swatches. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. And also, let me know down below, what is your favorite spring lipstick? I would love to know. Always on the hunt for new ones. Also, make sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye.